So then, your second fight, your you rematch know. with Spencer, was that, okay, so the first fight, Spencer takes it last minute against yourself. Did you take the second fight last minute with Spencer? No, no, because they had a setup as the main event for that one. Okay, uh, okay. Yeah, it was on a, a, a Spike TV fight night in Hollywood, Florida. Oh, nice. Uh, so, yeah, they, I mean, it was a good time. It was, uh, I was, yeah, I don't know, I thought, I maybe just being young and naive, I thought it was going to be the same fight. He made more adjustments than I did. He came in and Spencer Fisher, you know, went and that was Spencer in his prime, really. Like, those, I, you know, I think I was, that was still a little before my prime. I think Spencer was right kind of in the meat of his prime. Uh, he came in in good shape. He wanted that one back bad, you know, and we went, yeah, well, that was, was just, that well, was his- a fucking battle. Like, if but you really I, look at his training camp, it coincided with Jens Pulver and BJ Penn fighting. And Pulver and Fisher were, you know, big-time sparring partners. Yeah. So you knew he was coming in shape because he had a guy in the gym just constantly pushing him. Yeah. Yeah, he was uh, – but I just – the one thing I remember from that fight is uh, – coming back to the corner and I was, you know, going back and in hindsight. And I, one thing about me is I could never tell if I was winning or losing in, in the, <laughs> during the fight, unless it was like, <laughs> unless it was turning into a blowout. I was always like, yeah. did, I, did I win that round? I, but I remember <laughs> coming back to the corner and like, Sean's like, how do you feel? And I was like, I'm having a great fucking time. Like I was just, that was one of those fights where I, like we were eating eating punches, trading punches. And I just remember that being one of the most fun fights I ever had. Now, for the that's, first that's, one, you made 4000 How much did you get for the second one? <laughs> well, shit. Six. He got up 2000 <laughs> No. Yeah, yeah. So I went up to six. Yeah, because I in between that one, I lost that fight to Kenny Florian. Then I went and fought another fight in TKO and the, to defend the title. And then I came back for – so. But yeah, I got. I would have made, I yeah, I would have made six and six. But that was one of the first fight of the night bonuses they gave away. Okay. Really? How much yeah. was that worth? 15, 15 G's. Okay. okay. So, yeah, because I mean, they so started going think, up and up. I remember the the first one I was around was like a twenty thousand. I was like, oh my, God, what twenty thousand? But I mean, well, then the, they started really going up. Yeah, and that was and that was remember back in the day, Chris, when it was uh, it was based on the projected kind of earnings of the show. Yeah. Remember, it wasn't just 50 grand flat every time. It was like, if you were fighting on a Spike TV fight night, they were giving Yeah, 50. you didn't get... You well, 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 well. Because like, they're not going to make any money. I don't I want to fight on the pay-per-views. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah like, then, what, so what I the, I'm sorry. One of the things that happens now, though, is that the fighters get real excited. And I'm going for the bonus. I'm going to knock them out and stuff like that. Yeah. Did you even know that, that that was coming at that point? That, that was, That's at the point where that's a surprise, no? I mean, at that stage, it wasn't really like they didn't talk about the bonuses before it was like it, they just started giving them away actually the first time spencer and i fought i got a check from dana and a, a sign a, a, a typed out letter letter that was signed by dana saying thanks for putting it all out there and with a check for 500 bucks so that was my first 